Time for another youth video report, so... Hey guys, hope everybody's having a, a great day. Hope you've had a good week. Today's Saturday, and I hope that uh, you've got uh, some good uh, weekend plans to be able to spend with your family and your friends. But uh, anyway, guys, today I want to read a verse of Scripture to you from the Gospel of Matthew, uh, chapter 6, verse 34. And it says this, Therefore do not worry about tomorrow, for tomorrow will worry about its own things. Sufficient for the day is its own trouble. And... What this passage says to me is that, look, God's in control of these things. Uh, we don't need to spend a lot of time worrying and, and uh, a lot of times griping and complaining about things because God has, has it. Uh, we need to put our faith and our trust in Him and do the things that we know to do and let God take care of the rest. I think a lot of times we spin our wheels worrying about things that we absolutely have no control over and there's really nothing that we can do. But what we really need to do, as he says earlier in this uh, in his Sermon on the Mount, is seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and all these other things will be added to you. Uh, we're not going to be able to make, it won't make any difference if we worry or if we spend time just, uh, just you know, biting our nails, as some people do. I've never been one to bite my nails over things, but some people do that when they get nervous about something. God expects us to do the things that we can do. And then the things that we cannot lift up to Him in prayer and absolutely understand and just know that He is in total control of it. It may not exactly work out the way that we think it should or the way that uh, maybe even other people tell us that it should, but it works out in God's perfect time. And if it's if, if it's something that it's it's you know that we, we suffer through or we have a hardship. You know, God also offers us the strength and the comfort to be able to get through those things and come through it even stronger and have a great testimony afterwards to be able to tell people how God was able to get us through it. Anyway, guys, this is short. Don't worry about things, you know. Just spend time in prayer, and God will take care of the rest. Have a great day. God bless you. We'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye.